Three-time NPP flag bearer aspirant, Dr. Kofi Kunedwapriku. First timer, Dr. Free Akuto, as well as another serial contender, Jogate, faced the vetting committee on day three. After spending about two hours before the committee, economist Dr. Kunedwa Preku declined speaking with the media. Then came the former Greek minister, Dr. Ousuafri Akuto. How prepared are you for the exercise? Oh, well, it's a, it's a, it's a household domestic matter. So there's no preparation needed. Speaking to the media after his turn, the former Greek minister was confident his strategy was working. Okay, the campaign is going well. You know, we started Great Accra and the reception has been wonderful. We're going we're doing a tour of the regions. Not necessarily finishing every region before moving to another region. But it's just up, step and jump. Jogate, who is not new to the vetting process, is confident he will come out successfully. Arab, what are your expectations? The family conversation. I mean, I, I was vetted in 2014. So I'm going with no expectation. But the expectation that I will shine by God's grace. After taking his turn, his confidence of making it into the first five was still high. Everything is going according to plan. You don't do what everybody is doing. You do, you execute your plan. I'm at the place where I wanted to be at this time. And I'm very confident. God willing, I'll be part of the first five. He dispelled claims of a lack of a level playing field. Maybe you can, you can tell me about how the playing field is not level. So you don't think any of the candidates has been uh, favored against the others? Favored in what way? I mean, uh, you know, everything casts cast both ways. Favored in what way? There's an advantage in incumbency, there's a disadvantage in incumbency. Former Member of Parliament for Asante Mampon, Francis Adainimo, will be the next and last of the ten to be vetted on Thursday, July 6th.